Hi everyone, I'm Angela Allen, Assistant Head for Curriculum and Instruction here at Christ Church Episcopal School. And it's my privilege to provide you with an update on the 2017-2022 Strategic Plan. So as we've entered year three of our five-year plan, we have much to celebrate. There are many layers to our goals and action steps, but it's important to note that every goal is having an impact on the student experience. To help further illustrate the amazing work and progress that goes on each day in the spirit of our strategic plan, we've created a top five list. And while there's so much more to share, we hope this gives you some insight into where we are and a glimpse at where we're headed. So, with a little drum roll. Number five, our Episcopal identity. Obviously, this is the heart of who we are, and we've completed two formal in-service days to examine our Episcopal faith and what it means to be an Episcopal school, and how we operate as faculty to be more intentional about our identity. Our pastoral staff will be working on cataloging our all school events to reflect and build meaningful experiences for our community that celebrate who we are. Number four, service learning. Service learning continues to be an integral part of what we do here at Christ Church through service club, have back days, buddy programs, grade level opportunities across divisions. Our students are giving back and learning invaluable life lessons. Another exciting community partnership is taking shape through our junior summer internship program. This experience will provide students the opportunity to intern with local businesses and various organizations in the area over a two week period over the summer between their junior and senior years. Aspirationally, we also hope to engage our alumni in the spirit of building community through their roles as mentors in this program. Number three, advancement and admissions are taking it to the next level. We began the 2019-2020 school year with 1,115 students. To reduce reliance on tuition income and do the things that the strategic plan envisions, we continue to focus on building our endowment. The initiative began with an endowment of approximately $14 million. At present, we've raised $4.2 million in cash gifts, pledges, and deferred gifts. Number two, wellness. We continue to support physical, social, emotional, and spiritual wellness among students, employees, and our greater community. The student programming, such as the Social Institute, Calf Block in the upper school, Calf Time in the middle school, and morning meetings in the lower school are important staples in students' everyday schedules to discuss and practice strategies that maintain balance and develop healthy habits and choices. Through an endowment-funded program developed by the Synergy Group for our current freshmen, our ninth grade advisors are working with their students on coping strategies. And with the addition of our upper school counselor last year, as an action step for goal three, we now have a school counselor in every division. And finally, number one, the Cavalier Mindset. These Cavalier Mindset principles provide a guide or roadmap for all Cavaliers that are overarching and far-reaching. Growth mindset, grit, academic risk-taking, resilience, empathy, cooperation. These are core skill sets for all of us here at CCES. And the faculty and staff have really leaned into this over the last two years. Last year, all faculty and staff read the Growth Mindset Playbook, and we required all faculty members to have a minimum of two Growth Mindset experiences in the classroom. Milt Lauder, founder and CEO of Synergy Performance, helped us kick off Faculty Work Week. Essentially, we are walking the talk when it comes to these principles. And I look forward to updating you over the next three years to share and celebrate our success as a Cavalier community. Thank you for your continued support.